This morning, Florida Governor Ron DeSantis appears closer to announcing his run for the White House. Focusing on voters in Iowa who will be the first to cast ballots in 2024. Governor, what made you come here tonight? I just want to say hi to people. Over the weekend, DeSantis capitalized on a change of plans by former President Trump, adding a stop to a restaurant in Des Moines. Trump's campaign had postponed a rally hours earlier, just two miles away, citing a tornado warning. Canceled it. Big disappointment. It's been canceled for the night, unfortunately. Trump drawing skepticism for postponing his event. The communications director for a group supporting DeSantis tweeted a picture describing a beautiful Iowa evening. I've never seen a pork chop like that. <laughs> DeSantis also flipped burgers at a picnic fundraiser. The Des Moines Register described the event as a who's who of Iowa's top elected officials. DeSantis described what he called a culture of losing in the Republican Party without mentioning Trump by name. Governing is not about building a brand or, or, or talking on social media and virtue signaling. It's ultimately about winning and about producing results. Reacting to DeSantis's appearance, the Iowa Democratic Party chair said, no matter who ends up being the GOP nominee, it's clear MAGA Republicans support the most extreme candidates in our history. The most recent ABC News Washington Post poll of Republicans and GOP-leaning independents showed 51 percent prefer Trump to be the Republican nominee, more than double Governor Ron DeSantis, his nearest opponent. The poll was conducted before Trump was found liable for the sexual abuse of writer E. Jean Carroll. And DeSantis has been expected to make even more moves this week toward establishing an official White House campaign. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.